Okay, welcome back. So, uh, yeah, these uh, buildings are just finishing off being built. A um, couple of little changes. I I pushed them back a, a, by one space. I had uh, sort of a double wide road behind them and a single in front. So I've reversed that um, so these can lead up to like a two-way bridge going across here, which we can probably put in now. Let's, uh, let's wang those down. Oh, and I uh, changed this trailer back to an 8 uh, instead of a 6, so just to make it a little bit easier. So, so yeah, let's just throw bridge on either side. All this stuff. And, uh, yeah, so the fuel refinery is basically uh, it's going to make some furnace fuel for us from probably firewood to start with. Uh, but we're going to try and mix that up with charcoal, coal, and a few other sort of things just to uh, just to take the pressure off because uh, we want to try and get as much firewood as possible. So yeah, we probably need more um, logs. So let's repeat what we've done over here on this side. So we'll run a road. We'll run a road out. Uh, don't know how long it's got to be, so I'm just going to throw one out there. Let's um, let's see how long this road actually is. Thirty-nine. Okay. Uh, from there. Thirty-nine. Okay. So just at the corner of this bush. Let's get uh, new trees out. Let's make sure we've got the right model. We're going to go for the new style one. Give it a spin. And uh, yeah, I think I think that was right. Let's throw it in, just double check. Yep, 39. And uh, same old trick, a couple of abodes. One of our case barns. Medium. Throw that down. Lovely. Okay. A uh, lot of stone and iron in the way here. Let's get that shifted. I'll have all that. I'll come in handy. I don't want to go too far out. Because I'm trekking all the way across the map to get it, but. Yeah, we're probably going to maybe extend these roads a bit more, maybe put some more um, foresters in. Uh, not a problem this way, but um, the way that the river undulates and comes up this end, it's going to be a bit trickier here, so we're going to lose. So we're, They're not going to be maximised, but it's still going to offer uh, a serious amount of log production. So yeah, that's what we want. Um, right, okay, so that's in. Now hopefully the uh, the log tally will rise. Let's um, prioritise getting this done. Okay, what next? What next? Well, um, yeah, we need more canal coming down here, don't we? So we can join it up to here. Let's work from this direction. Uh, we haven't got any storage up here, so we've got those two have finally been built. Um, so yeah, let's probably throw in some canal storage, and we'll do it on the side, this sort of side, so it's easy for them to get access to. Let's put a couple of pieces in. Okay, room for more, possibly actually. Let's uh, let's see. Okay. Because, uh, yeah, what I want to do is I want to jut the canals out each way as well. So, yeah, I'm going to need a four-way piece here. And it's just making sure it's lined up right. In fact, yeah, I think that's going to be sweet. Perfect. Okay, so we've got fish canal, canal dock. So another fishing dock in here. Wait. I'm going to the storage in and a filler piece. 
There we go. Okay. Now, this um, river, we didn't flatten all of it, so it's going to be getting in the way of this uh, forester. So, in fact, I think this one's done, so let's, um, let's set him up. And then we'll use the power uh, terrain flattening tool. We're just going to sort this out. We are going to lose some resources, but they'll, uh, they'll get replanted, so... Okay, that's all done. That'll do the job. And uh, yeah, our forester will uh, reseed this area. We could probably do with doing the same on the other side, actually, couldn't we? Because uh, we're getting to that point now. Um, let's, uh, let's flatten that. Now, if we're going to jut out, we're going to need to remove a little bit of this road, so let's just take a chunk out there. And we're going to want to shorten the canal. Um, we've kept it as eight going along here, but we're going to shorten this to like a six. So, hopefully we can do that once all this gets removed. It doesn't take too long. So, uh, yeah, in the menu system, it's the JX. And... Uh, you get a, like, a reduction from 8 to 6 or 6 to 4. So we're going to go with the 8 to 6. And hopefully get this done before it starts snowing. Yeah, chuck that in there. Then we're going to need a, a 6 wide bridge. Again with the same model we're using all the way through. It's the first sort of slatted model. And yeah, okay. That's the, um, the sort of jutting out bit start over that way. Really, we sort of need to do the same here. So, let's put in, uh, go back to the 8x8, eight eight, four way piece. Bang that down. And then we want to go, oh, again, difficult to see. Yeah, okay. One canal dock. One fishing dock. Two canal docks. More fish. More storage and the fill a piece. Sweet. Okay, so again, I'm gonna risk it <laughs> with a join a piece, eight by six. I presume it's gonna go there. And uh, go back to the six um, lengths and get the bridge. I think that is right, sort of eyeing it. That's, yeah, that looks right to me. Okay. So we've got, um, yeah, we've got a few bits and bobs on the go. Um, still, really, we need more people, don't we? Let's put another school on this side. The Japanese style. You'd probably be wondering why I haven't put any churches in, and uh, it's purely for the reason that uh, I don't really have anywhere to put them, to be honest. Um, I've sort of got an idea of what I want to get in this section, and because we're trying to squeeze as many different buildings for the production chains in as small a space as possible, um, yeah, there's no real room. I mean, I could put something down here if I wanted to, but I'd only end up moving it later on. So, uh, yeah, they can. Um, they can be atheistic for the time being, and then uh, we'll introduce religion a little bit later on. Uh, they seem to be happy. Four and a half stars. Four hearts. So, herbs is okay. I think we're only really down to one herbalist as well. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, so it's just about managing. I should really put that up to two. But I'm going to. Because it might be a while before we can get herb seeds and that. You can see we're not doing that well with the firewood. So, we really need to start concentrating on getting maybe another person in each of the foresters uh, yeah 
So I'm getting there slowly, getting there slowly. Right, what are we going to do for this section? Well... Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to hang fire with the fishing guys for the time being. Where are we at with that? I should be up for 11, shouldn't it, really? Um, Food-wise, it's going up. It's what we want. I want it to just keep going up because we're going to have loads of people on this map. So the more food we can store in the sort of early start of the game, the better. Um, so with that in mind, what have we got there? We've got canal, fish, canal. So we could put two more. Times eight fishing docks. On that side, give it a spin. And one there, yeah, okay. I just wanted to see where we'd be jutting out with the road. So yeah, I'm going to put a little bit of a mark, just so I know how much space I've got to use. So yeah, in this section, we're going to try and sort of ramp up the uh, production chains. So we've got furnace fuel. What else are we going to need? We're going to need um, furnishings. I do like furnishings. It's one of my favourite items to make. And for that, we're going to need hardwood. And so we're going to need to get some hardwood guys on the go. And some joiners. So, join us, join us, join us, where are you? Join us, okay, now these are quite big buildings, so um, take quite a lot of space. So I'm going to shunt these just into the corner. I'll put a couple in. Like so. Um, what's our build account? Let's pause these for the time being, because our build account is quite high. A little bit of road mark out on top of those. Let's give that a double. Yeah, and that sort of lines up quite nicely with these bridges. So, bringing stuff. Okay, so what have we got? We've got joiners. We need bedding, guys. What do we need for bedding? Cloth and cotton. Uh, and we're going to need candles as well, so channelers. Right, okay. Um, let's have a play with the channelers. Um, can we get a couple in there? Oh, yes, we can. Oh, that's sweet. Okay, they fit nicely. Again, just putting these on pause for now. Right, so yeah, with uh, furnishing, so just a mental reminder of, of uh, what we need. We need, yeah, bedding, uh, furnishings, uh, fancy furniture, sorry, and that comes from the hardwood and the joiners, candles. So yeah, bedding really, isn't it? Um, hmm. well, I'll tell you what, before we do that, let's try and get some hardwood guys set up. Let's go back into our canal system. Eight piece, bridge. And yeah, let's overlay that a bit closer so we can see. Yeah, that one. We'll do the same on this side. lines up and we're pretty much going to do the same thing as we did here we're just going to jut out to the side and uh, put some hardwood foresters in so as I was saying before central section for all the work and uh, yeah some forestry areas around the side with some houses shooting straight up the canal and we've left room so that if we want to double uh, these rows up we can do uh, if we look at the foresters we've got a bit of room at the back we can put some more houses there if we need to so that's not a problem um, now, what's going on here? Oh, it's just that Philippines isn't built yet. Okay. So, 
So now we're getting working up, aren't we? We're getting closer to our uh, our natives. So um, yeah, now dun, 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 dun. let's get a road and let's run this out. Stick it there for the time being. So yeah, also I uh, forgot to mention we've uh, got a new mod which uh, changes the colour of the circles to a, a, sort of brighter, slightly darker blue, a lot easier to see. So uh, yeah, if you uh, were wondering why it was blue and not yellow, that's just an extra mod, again from uh, Kralyug's Cave, so uh, a good place to check out at uh, colonialcharter.com in the forum, so uh, loads of mods in there that we use in these series. Um, so yeah. Foresters, foresters, and new trees. So we sort of want to do the same thing again, really. Um, put a couple of foresters in. Are we going to leave any room at the front here? I don't know if we need to, really. Um, maybe a little bit. Yeah, leave a little bit of room, just in case we want to put some more houses up there. Um, so yeah, rinse and repeat, forest of hardwood, new trees, town abodes, two of, medieval barn, medium size, and a stockpile. And we want it as long as it can be, so 30. Yeah, takes it nicely up to the uh, to the forester. Okay, and uh, yeah, we sort of want to do the same on the other side, don't we? So we'll do that, and then uh, we'll leave the episode there. And then when we come back, I'll have, I'll have let these build, and uh, and then we can sort of move on. So let's get this other side in. work out where the road's going to be. So that's the two. Now, yeah, let's see. Let's try and get these right. That's sort of equal on each side. And 28. Lovely. Right, um, Forrester. You know the drill now. Okay, all done. So, uh, yeah, as you can see, uh, two decent sized foresters here, two more of the uh, hardwood foresters. We'll probably put another uh, hardwood forester here, so I'd have like me two of these. So, four in total, and uh, again, yeah, more like mm, one and a half each side, so three. Um, of the, uh, the normal foresters, and uh, that should be generating us a decent amount of uh, of logs and hardwood, uh, which these joiners can, uh, if I can click on them, yep, can turn into uh, into hardwood for our our fancy. Well, uh, what did they turn them into? Sorry, fancy furniture for our furnishings. And the reason I put four in is because, um, well, fancy furniture itself is uh, is worth decent money. So uh, you know we could have two. Uh, crew, you know, supplying fancy furniture for the furnishings and another two just for fancy furniture, you know, for us to sell. Um, so, yeah, it's better for that to be a little bit overpowered, I think. That's why I want to try and get four uh, of the hardwood foresters on the go in close proximity to these joiners. So, so yeah, with on that note, I'll uh, see you in the next episode and hopefully it'll be a little less snowy. See you soon.